Mariner 2 heads to space, the first CAT scan is introduced, and Microsoft rolls out a new operating system. It all happened this week in tech history. This week in 1962, the U.S. launched the Mariner 2 space probe using an Atlas D booster. Later that year, Mariner 2 passed within just over 20,000 miles of Venus, reporting an 800 degree Fahrenheit surface temperature, high surface pressures, a predominantly carbon dioxide atmosphere, continuous cloud cover, and no detectable magnetic field. In 1972 this week, the computed axial tomography, or CAT scan, was introduced in England by British engineer Godfrey Hounsfield and by physicist Alan Cormack. The history of X-ray computed tomography actually goes back to at least 1917 with the mathematical theory of the radon transform. In October of 1963, William Oldendorf received a U.S. patent for a radiant energy apparatus for investigating selected areas of interior objects obscured by dense material. However, Hounsfield's invention was the first commercially viable CT scanner. And this week in 1995, Microsoft officially rolled out their Windows 95 operating system. Midnight parties at retailers across the U.S. offered the new system for sale to those who just couldn't wait any longer. NBC's Jay Leno hosted the official launch party at the Microsoft campus in Redmond, Washington. The company lit up the Empire State Building with the Windows 95 logo colors and licensed the Rolling Stones song Start Me Up to use in its advertisements for $12 million. That's our look back at This Week in Tech History, brought to you by IFA in Berlin. IFA, the Global Innovations Show. Meet the official partner of the future in Berlin. Hey everyone, Cameron Graveline here. Remember, call in Winstop. Thank you. Visit us online at intotomorrow.com where you can find out how to listen to our weekly Into Tomorrow radio program and subscribe to our free podcasts. Catch you next time on This Week in Tech History.